this is Martin Delane of the Copenhagen Voice. I'm at a conference about women's employment, women's empowerment. With me is Helen Clark, the administrative head of the UNDP. Helen Clark, a hundred years ago we were talking of women's emancipation. Now we're talking of women's empowerment. Is this the one route you see for improving the conditions of women throughout the world? Well, uh, I come from a country where women first gained the right to vote for national parliaments. But what we found was not a lot moved for women until women actually were able to enter the parliament and take up positions in decision making at very high levels, actually across the board. Because when you get the critical mass of women, you get women's issues beginning to be given priority, beginning to be uh, addressed. So I think underlying the achievement of all development goals for women is supporting women's voice in the process, active participation in the process, and I can't understate the importance of that. But also economically? Oh, e economically as well, because you have to create, of course, the legal uh, platform from which women actually can assert themselves economically. If you can't hold a land title, if you can't open a bank account without your husband's permission, if you can't access a credit because you haven't got any uh, collateral, if you can't inherit, uh, that's certainly going to hold you back in being economically empowered. How great a um, benefit 